Alright, so then we're going to do a game review on Ninja Gaiden. Here we go, play Ninja Gaiden for the NES. So basically we're getting to the cutscene of the game. And actually it's interesting because this is off a Nintendo game. Yeah, very interesting. I mean look at the sequence. It all fits in. This is awesome. Now it shows the two ninjas jumping into the moon with the slash of two swords and it's a flash of light. That is awesome. So this game is made by Tecmo, 1989. Intro is interesting. It says Ninja Gaiden. Push start. Of course I like the story intro. It's pretty breathtaking. It's funny how people actually say the name Ryu but it's Ryu. Wait a minute, is this from Street Fighter or something? Nobody really knows how to say the name Ryu. Some people say Ryu. Some people say Ryu. So is it Ninja Gaiden or Gaiden? Okay, I like how it says Act 1 on the screen and it shows the animation of the ninja pop up. That is awesome. I like it with the ninja and the music. It goes good with the slash of the sword. Alright, so we start up the game and basically, uh, it says ninja and enemy. I guess ninja means your life, and enemy means the boss's life. And it's both on the right top corner of your screen. And then you have your score, uh, timer. Are you kidding me? What kind of bullcrap is this? You're timed on the game? Yeah, they time you. Yeah. Okay, so on top of the name Ninja, it says stage. And it says one slash the other number, which is two, so that means level one, stage two. So basically we get to the game, and the enemies take one hit. Yeah, one hit. Okay, the ninja's pretty cool, but who the fuck is this guy? He has some kind of sword, machete, or a spear? And what the hell is he wearing? Some kind of mask? I mean, come on now. If he's supposed to be a ninja, why don't they disguise him as a ninja? Like the ninja you see on the screen! Okay, the jumping ain't too bad either. What the fuck is that? Some kind of rat? Just followed me from behind. Okay, who the fuck's this guy in the pink? Showing me his dukes? Are you fucking kidding me? Another thing I like about this game is when you're the ninja and you jump with the sword and you hit one of these lanterns, they give you special items like a weapon in the top, bottom, middle corner of your screen. Another thing I like when he flips from one wall to the next. That's awesome. Okay, now who the hell is this guy with the boxing gloves? This ain't Mike Tyson's punch out, you know. Okay, as you get to the boss, this is the first boss on this stage. Look at how fucking easy he is. I just go back and chop him more. And bam! He's already defeated. How can you make the first boss so damn easy to defeat? Well, this one is. Alright, here we go. More flipping and jumping. Alright, so... Alright, what the hell? Where'd that rat come from? And it comes back again. What the fuck? Alright, here we go. What the fuck? If you want him to get on the platform, get on that fucking platform. What the fuck? He still won't get on it. Okay, what do I do here? I can't get on the platform. I still can't get on the platform. Oh, just die in a hole. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? That's all I had to do was jump on that platform like that? Now, I have to admit, using the flames on the enemies is pretty damn good. Alright, what the fuck is that shit? I bounce right back and go into a hole? Okay, another part I don't understand is who the fuck's this G.I. Joe commando? What the fuck? He just keeps coming every time. Um, and then the other thing is, look at this shit. The bird just keeps coming every time. And the bat just keeps popping up. And that's fucking bullshit. Just die? So I just keep going up. Keep going up. What the fuck? Alright, here we go. And of course, 
freaking G.I. Joe Commando comes up again. I hate that fucking bird. Every time I try to jump, there is no way to escape that fucking bird. Oh, take that, asshole. And I still die. What kind of bullshit is this? What kind of bullshit is this? A guy spins up in the air, does his kicks in the air? And who the hell is this? Some fucked up Jason character throwing axes at me? What the fuck? Who the fuck are these goblin looking dudes? What the fuck? I can hardly hit him. He just keeps jumping like sh fucking crazy. Take that, with new star. Okay, here we go. Now we're at the boss. See if we can beat the boss. Oh, that's fucking bullshit. It's hard to dodge the damn fireballs. Look at this shit. Who the hell can beat this shit? It's so fucking impossible. Even the Ninja Star doesn't do shit. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, die you fucking piece of shit. I, what the fuck? What the fuck? What kind of bullshit is this? Why am I back at the first stage of this fucking level? Fuck! Since I need help to beat this game, I'm gonna connect to my subconscious and meditate. Please hear me now. I need help with this game. Can you help me with this game? I can help you with this game. But you must believe in your instincts. What instincts? The power of the mind is very strong. You must connect with it. But I can't. I can't beat this game. You must not give up. You move slow. You must move fast. You must be quick. I will show you how to beat this game. You don't know how to concentrate with the mind. That is why you suck. A lot of people tell me this is Ninja Gaiden. But can you tell me what is really the name? The name? It's not hard to understand. Instead of Gaiden, it's called Ninja Gaiden. So how are you going to beat it? Watch and learn. Well, this goes to show, not even a ninja with fast speed can beat this fucking game. And I would say, Ninja Gaiden 2, it's hard. Ninja Gaiden 3, it's fucking ridiculous.